So we now have a sweet, ultra sweet Vidalia onion. Take the top off. to the side. Root up, slice down, cutting it in half perfectly. Bring it up as a crescent. Peel the outer layer, because we don't want that in there. Saggy might put it in there somewhere, but we certainly don't want. And then we have a perfectly clean, ah, get that little skin off of there, see? Doing it to me again. Perfectly halved sweet onion. Slice it root to the top. Root to the top. And the thinner you make these cuts, the more minced it will start at the very beginning. Don't cut the root, keep the root whole. You are less likely to cry and tear up. Unless you're truly just having an emotional day and it's gone awry and you must be there. So we have feathered the onion out and we have worked within its own layers, as you can see. Then just take it and slice it down and it falls off into all the little perfect squares as an onion should, layer by layer, knuckles to the blade. The Vidalia onion comes from a secret place and very precious sweet soil. And they're only available certain times of the year. But any good firm onion will do. And don't forget the shallot as well. A shallot is the sweetest of the onions. Very tender, very mild. Once again, take off the top. Slice it through the root once, have it like a little crescent moon. Peel the outside of it. You don't want any onion skin. It would make it oh so bitter. Let's get the Vidalia out of the way and welcome the shallot. Slice it long ways. The thinner you slice it, the tiny it'll be. Hold it together for those last few rows. Take it in your hands, knuckles out. And the wonderful, beautiful scent of the shallot and lobes you. There you have it.